I do want to know how you feel about vaccine passports. That is. Is that so? What it's pretty self. It's like um, but it's saying so. It's saying that you're vaccinated against COVID. But what does yeah. it permit you to do? So apparently, I think this is only in New York. Uh, if you have a vaccination, they'll let you do more things. Like if like you if what? you if you prove that you have a vaccination, um, then they'll allow you to like go into like Madison Square Garden, larger like events and whatnot. That that's what the proposition is. I don't know if it passed or not. Like, how do you feel about that? I don't. I so hmm, I don't know. Here's my thing. Like, I don't care. I'm not getting vaccinated and I take responsibility for that. And so whatever that means for me is what I'm going to stand by. If I'm not allowed to do something, I'm not going to do it. And if I was vaccinated, like I'm still going to wear my mask anyways, because the vaccine, from my understanding, you could still get COVID just not to as a severe degree and you could still carry it and pass it on. So like, why would I not wear my mask? I don't trust nobody. I think that's one of the things that people are upset about though. It's like, um, I think I thought saw Ben Shapiro talking about it. He's upset that when you get the vax, the vaccine, you still have to wear a mask that really bothers him. Well, that's like at my job, they were like, Oh, if you're in a room with another person who was vaccinated, you could take your mask off. And it's like, you're an idiot. We work in group homes and you could still carry it. So regardless if we're going out and doing whatever we want, like you could still carry it into the group home and kill every person we support. So like, is it that important to you to take your mask off? Yeah. Right. Just for like, you know, a little bit of, like, I don't really find it that much of an inconvenience. And if I did, I'm going to pay for it my own way and be stuck in my house. Yeah, right. I get that. Me personally, I don't give a shit. Like, I'm not vaccinated, uh, but I work from home anyway. But, um, like, if it makes it so I can't do some things, then that's life, man. You know what I mean? Like, I'm still allowed to go to the grocery store and live like a person. I just can't go to, like, big events. But, like, <clears throat> those are priorities. Do we want to go to big events? I don't, <laughs> no. so I don't care. <laughs> But if you do, get vaccinated, you know? Like, you should be taking the precautions regardless. Because you also don't know how this... We got... They got the vaccines for, like, whatever strand. And this thing has already... Evolved. Evolved and changed into different things. There's so many different strands. Like, it's just not worth it. I think, personally. Yeah, I I agree with that. I don't give a shit. COVID can't beat this. (sighs) My shoulder really hurts from the a lot of pain from moving in yeah I, we did a lot of work that was a while monday ago. and then i put this uh, so i have a new desk i put together really upset about it i it took me forever it's like an l desk it's cool it looks nice i was using like uh, an old like what a plastic desk yeah like a party table like a party table that was like flimsy but i liked it i'm very like i like um i like ghetto stuff is that what you'd call that like I guess so. We just don't we don't necessarily care about proper things. Yeah, right. You know. As long as it works. Like white trash, that's what I am. Desk reveal, I I'll do it on like a TikTok. It looks really nice though. I will say that's I will really say nice. that. Hey everyone, if you liked that video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And don't forget to follow my Twitch, Instagram, Twitter, Discord, and TikTok. All links are in the description. Also, check out my Patreon if you'd like to support me even more than you already do. Thank you so much, everyone. I love you all.